comes Kirk Cousins now to lead his offense back out there. How do you think he personally is evaluating his game so far? He was pretty good in the first half, been good so far here in the third quarter. He's got to like it, right? Not looking for the dramatics here. Not trying to set the world on fire in terms of stats. It's almost like you're driving. Hands at 10 and 2, alert for anything out there, watching for trouble on the road, and making sure you get the team home. The bus driver. See who can drive the bus here again on this drive. Now here's a pass on first down that's knocked away and incomplete. It's always a battle. Who's going to win on first down, the offense or the defense? Let's face it, if you've got the ball, four yards or more on first down is what you're aiming for. They tried to throw for it there. Nice effort to knock that one away and bring up second down. A second down throw for Cousins. And he takes a shot on the release as this will be incomplete. Right, let's go ahead and detail this situation here. Third and long coming up. Back near your own goal line. I would be very hesitant about throwing the football in this situation. Maybe just run, run up the middle. Yeah, I think that that might be the spot for them. you got to try and find some space for your punter because you don't want him backed up where he has to alter what he does. Play fake, Cousins. And he's able to find Diggs. Touchdown, Vikings. Stephon Diggs, 95 yards. And the Vikings are going to add on to their lead. Well, they were back in the shadows to their own goal post, and that flipped quickly. So much for playing it safe. I mean, a conservative, easy call. Run the football, take care of it, create some space, pump the ball away, but no, let's throw it. And sometimes a defense's aggressiveness is used against them because when you've got people backed up, your natural inclination is to try and really force them back, and sometimes they get burned.